Alright guys, uh, this is Fierce Modder, also known as Fierce Waffle, and this is my second tutorial on uh, C-sharp programming. This tutorial is getting an external IP. The first, sorry I had to cough. The first thing we're going to do is uh, create a new project. Let's rename this get x ip okay now what we're going to do is um, in the ui form one cs design create a new button uh, text is going to be get ip in the, l the name which is what it'll be used for when you're coding uh, we'll just keep it as uh, get IP. You can't have any spaces in your name. Um, now we're going to create a new label. Keep the name as label1. Text IP will appear here. Alright. Uh, we're just going to dock this at the bottom so it looks a little cleaner, like so. Alright, now we're going to double click the get IP button like I just did, and we'll get a new uh, event handler. Now, after we have that, we're going to type UTF-8 encoding. UTF-8 equals new UTF-8 encoding and then call the function. Um, web client, crap. Web client, web client equals new web client. Ooh, uh, using system system.net alright uh, now that we've done that we're going to type string oops string external IP equals utf8 dot get string web client dot download data and then uh, HTTP shift colon forward slash forward crap uh, forward slash forward slash what is my IP dot com forward slash automation forward slash n zero nine two three oh nine Four five dot xp and then close brackets close brackets semicolon. Now we're gonna do label one dot text equals external ip semicolon. All right, now we're gonna run it and of course I'm gonna have to uh and then. What I'm doing right here, so that way you guys don't see my entire IP, because I don't want to be giving that out. Uh, string after IP equals uh, external IP dot text external IP dot remove uh, five. I'm just removing fi right here. I'm just removing five digits from my IP, so that way you guys don't. Yeah. Alright, dot remove eight. Um now label one dot text wow, sorry. Dot text equals after IP semicolon. Um when you guys are doing this, you're not gonna use this. You're just gonna make this uh equals external IP. Let's run this. And then those are the first few digits of my IP address. 
have to make this remove three. As you can see, when I press the button, get IP, it changes it to changes this label to my IP address. That's as much as my IP address as I'm gonna give you guys, seven six dot two five dot two three. Um hopefully this tutorial helped you. I will include the code in the description. Um hopefully it helped you in some way, maybe securing your program. Um yeah. Thanks for watching.